Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to check for software updates that are available for your Epson printer. And this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is open up the search menu and type in control panel. Best result, sure come back with control panel. Go ahead and open that up. So you're view by in the top right to large icons, and then you want to select devices and printers. And now you want to go down and select printers and scanners on this list, and then select the Epson printer, and then go down and select printing preferences. Select the more options button. Select the maintenance tab, and then select software update. It should say check for printer updates now. The software does not extract or transmit any personal information from your computer. Before you begin, make sure you have an internet connection. Would you like to continue? Select yes. And then you can see applicable software that's available, so the essential product updates. And then they usually have additional software as well. If you want to update, you can. You don't have to necessarily. That's why they're optional. So if you want to update the Epson printer connection checker, you can have that installed in here, as well as the scan smart. And I'm going to go ahead and select install two items. And then I'm going to select yes if I receive a user account control prompt. Agree to the license terms and then select OK. And it should read that the installation was successful once it has concluded. And you just would select OK. And that's pretty much it. You can see the other ones we opted not to install are still here, but we can just close out of here at that point. We don't have to install them. And that's pretty much it. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.